Welcome back to the My Manage Career with Wrexham, and we've got three big matches coming your way in this one. But first, we're going to talk a little bit more about the squad depth. We are going to trial a couple of players in this episode with Val uh, starting up in the striker position. That will be in game two. And then we'll potentially look at uh, who can potentially play in the left or right back once McLean does retire. So Mendy will also get an opportunity in this episode. Uh, in the middle of the field, we could potentially move Russell up to a cam position as well. It is his preferred position, but obviously Lee has been playing phenomenally in that one as well. We could look to potentially also change up the tactics and go with a, a two cam role uh, in the squad uh, with the centre defensive mid. Um, so a couple of options we can look at doing over the course of the next couple of episodes, getting ourselves ready for the back end of the season. Uh, but we will, in this episode, uh, give uh, Fall uh, an opportunity up front in the striker position. He's young. He's got plenty of upside. Let's see if um, if he fits within the, the squad and the play style that we currently use. And then, of course, we'll also give Bolton and Mandy an opportunity to play on the right back position and then Mendy on the left, uh, give McLean a bit of a break in that second match. But first up, we've got a big one. It's going to be Fleetwood. This match is part of the EFL Trophy Tournament. Uh, so vital three points for us to get out of the group stage. Uh, we are at home in front of home fans, which is great. We're at the race course. Hopefully we can put in a big performance. We're definitely going to need this man here. Paul Mullen scored four goals in his last three matches. He's on absolute fine form at the moment. And we're definitely going to need to utilise that throughout the course of this match. It's a battle. But we're ready for it. That's the squad we're looking at. We've got Marriott, Mullen up front, Lee. We've got Russell and Rathbone in the centre midfield position. Dobson round out the centre defensive mid. And then that back line of Brute and Clearworth. The two young guns at the moment playing phenomenally well together. So we've continued with that uh, set up, being that uh, we're kind of planning for the future a little bit there. We need to develop up. Uh, Brunt, get him ready for if we potentially do get another promotion where we're currently sitting in first position. So that is a likelihood if we continue this momentum. There's a big miss there. We're going to need Barnett to get back on this one. Nice play there by Cleworth. He slows it down and Rathbone gets a foot to it. Nice play. Dobson down to Lee here. Mullins run the line. Good line there but defensively. Fleetwood Town slid across well there and, and broke it up. We've got Brute trying to get there, bomb with the ball. Oh, you're kidding me, 13 minutes in, down the short side. I thought we had that one covered. Conquo. unfortunately, lets one in. I think that's an easy, easy shot attempt to save. Down the short side. Didn't have a whole lot of power, but unfortunately we're down by one here, 15 minutes in. Rathbone here, will chip over the top to Mullen, but unfortunately, defensively, they got in the way on that one. Clearworth trying to fight defensively on that. Missed there by Brute. Recovered well there though, great defensive play, slowed it down, caused a mistake. Got one minute in here. Arnett, Ratbone, down to Marriott. Just took a little bit too long to try and get that ball through the Mullen. Russell sliding across. McLean's going to have to push it and be aggressive here. Nice play there by the captain, but he doesn't get the ball back. Johnston at the moment's got it. That's an easy save there for a compo. Corner here for Fleetwood. Short ball here, we should be able to hold on to it. We do well, Rathbone with the ball. Out to Russell, slows it down, finds Barnett. Does have Lee running the line on the inside. It's Marriott, sorry. Ball to Marriott. No, it's actually Lee, sorry. Chip over the top. The confusion of the blue boots on that one. We might need to switch it up. We got Brunt with the ball. Barnett. 
Out to Russell. Down to McLean. Down to Lee. In that half wing position. Into Mullen. Oh, that was close. Lee fights for it again. Mullen with the ball. Tries to turn. Can't do it. Gets the ball back here. Shot. Fleetwood. Getting in front of the, the shots at the moment. They're playing well defensively. Ball goes wide here. Russell, nice defensive play. He's got Lee on the inside, but he finds Mullen down there in the box. Rathbone with the ball here. Back to Russell. Defensively. Fleetwood just some mother in us at the moment. And we're going to go into the break, unfortunately. 1 0 down. We've got the whole second half here to potentially bounce back here, but Brom, that goal, I feel like was a soft one for us. We were we were there to cover this shot on the inside with the defender. Conquo should have should have covered the short side a little bit better. But life moves on here. McLean with the ball with a beautiful into oh. That was a beautiful header if it was just on target. And a nice delivery there by McLean. Keeper comes out. Ooh, that would have been would have been a highlight reel goal if, if he was able to capitalise on it. Lee with the ball. Down to Russell. Got Mullen. Beautiful pass through. Defensively. They were able to smother us on that one, but we do have a penalty just outside the box. Lee's been close a couple of times through the series. Can he put this one in? 18 metres out. Over the top of the wall. Just above the bar. Just needed a little bit lower. 52 minutes in here. Backbone should get the ball there. He does well. Down to Russell. Down to Lee. Settles it. He's going to find Mullen here. He's going to find Barnett. Defence on him at the moment. Bennett battling it out with Barnett. Barnett trying to get the ball back here. He does well. He does recover it here. Down to Marriott. Pass was wayward. Ball back into the centre field. Nice steal there by Dobson. Gets the ball out to McLean. Down to Lee here. Settles himself. Lee! Close. Corner here. What can we do here? Put it on a dime. Underneath. Unfortunately, he hit Brunt's chest and he wasn't able to get a foot to it. Ball into the middle. Barnett, nice defensive play, but it's going to be a penalty, unfortunately. Clearance here. Can we get in front of it? It's a bad miss there by Russell. Nice play there by McLean and Dobson, but does a poor pass by McLean. Compo with a beautiful save there. Clear work. Down to Rathbone. Back to Rathbone here. It's a beautiful pass down to Marriott. Steps back. Great ball into Mullen. Mullen, yes! 74th minute, 13th of the season. Marriott to Mullen. A beautiful goal. Have a look at that. Spin, put the ball in a spot where only he could get it. And we tie it all up here, 74th minute. Ball back in the middle here. Got plenty of time to get this second goal just got to defend well ball across Johnson with it nice play there by McLean but he does cross it into the box and Barnett once again strong in defence just not his attack that's been impressive this season it's a poor pass there by Russell but Marriott fights for it ball goes out to Barnett down to Marriott right there Marriott here he's going to find Mullen in the box blocked Keeper with the good saves there. 85th minute. 
You need to get the ball back quick here. Russell with the miss. Oh, McLean's overcommitted. Brunton sliding across. Ball back into the box. Dobson. Clearworth. Nice play there by Clearworth. Rathbone. Down to Mullen. Gets on the outside, but again, defensively, Fleetwood. Cutting us off at the last second. Ball down here. Brunt's going to have to slide across. Please don't let a goal get in here. Dobson fine for it at the moment. Nice play there by Dobson. Oh, you're kidding me. A penalty. Extra time inside the box. I don't see that as a penalty. But the refs called it. And this could be devastating. Conquo. Oh, Conquo! What a save! Clearance out there by McLean. I for sure thought we lost that one. He might have not really reacted well to the short ball for the first goal. But he come up aces in the end. Make sure we at least walk away with the one point. A 48-52 split on possession. And Mullen was our best player with a 9.8. What a performance there by Conquo. But next, let's jump straight into the second match. Let's get keep this action alive. We've got a League One match. And that's our defence at the moment. We are the best defensive squad in League One with only conceding four goals so far. We are going to do that uh, switch around in this one. As mentioned, Mofal up the front and then Jacob Mendy on that left back. And then you've got Bolton on the right. So a few changes. Hopefully we can continue the momentum and it doesn't disrupt too much, but it will be a good opportunity to see how these players do play. Obviously, Fowler is only 21 years of age, striker position. It could mean that we don't need to transfer someone in if he could be the next one to kind of step up for us. Obviously, Marriott and Mullen have been on tremendous form, but the youth of of foul could be an option and we will probably need to look to start to develop him soon if if that's the case if he does fit our play style Rathbone with the ball here down to Bolton got foul on the inside he finds him he's got Mullen gets blocked up there by the defender keeper's got the ball Lee's going to slide across here ball into the middle Dobson's going to have to slide Brown's got the ball at the moment. Down to James. Into the middle. NG. Mendy, nice defensive play there. Ball out to Bolton here. Oh, that's a beautiful ball down to foul. He turns. He shoots. He scores his first. No foul. Getting the ball from Bolton, who's given the opportunity to impress in this one. In that right back position. He turns on the two defenders here, Fall. And he just sinks the first goal of his career here at Wrexham in front of the home fans, 18 minutes in. That will settle, settle the nerves for the kid. And Bolton delivered his first assist, I believe, of the season. Nice play by him. Clearworth with the ball. Bolton... Currently going downfield, chip into the box. It's going to be a little bit too far there. Ball into the middle here. A bit frustrating. Doesn't allow you to switch players while the ball's in the air. Probably would have said Dobson was in a better position. Russell with the ball here. Lee finds Mullen. Down to Mendy. Mendy takes a shot. Ooh, that's close. Try to sneak it in on the short side come off him last as well so goalkeeper's ball ball into the middle and this is what I'm talking about trying to switch across to Rathbone there and it just would not let me take it off clear work that's an interesting 
thing they've added to it. But Mullen, oh, with a beautiful line there. Hopefully that's a, a patch uh, to come with the, with the game at the moment where it doesn't let you switch players when the ball is in the open. But Mullins with the ball here, does have foul. And defensively, Beckles comes straight behind him on that one and just pickpockets him. Of course, in the corner. 37 minutes in here, ball into the middle. Cleared here, down to Russell, down to Rathbone, shots. Ooh, close there. He was sliding across here. He's working with Bolton. There's a strong combination with Barnett. He's killing that one by Clearworth. Brunt's going to have to slide here. Fortunately, NG scores first for them. Or well, scores their first, sorry, not the, the first of the match. Clearworth and Bolton really not working well on that play down the right-hand side. Both missing tackle attempts. You've got Brunt sliding across trying to support. And Okonkwo was just left all alone to try and save that one. All tied up here, 45th minute. So we will go into the break. Basically, a fresh 45 minutes, a fresh game, nothing really changing on the scoreboard. Fouls played well. I think uh, he's, you know, performed exactly how we'd hope in that striking position. He's got himself in space. He's got some clean ball. He's battled it out with the defenders. So hopefully we can see a little bit more. That's a poor pass there for Mendy, though. Putting us in a real tough spot. Locked there by Clearworth. And then Rathbone with the ball. Down to Lee. Got Mullen running a beautiful line here, but defensively Beckles fights for it at the moment. He does get the ball away from Mullen. Mendy turned around, defensively missed him on that one. Brunt's going to have to slide across. And miscues on that one as well, Clearworth. Just comes in aggressively, knocks it out of bounds. Let's us reset. Ball back into the middle here. Nice play there by Clearworth. Defensively, he's been great this series. Russell with the ball. Down to Lee. Sets himself. Mullen. Tries to get it back to Lee there. Which is a poor pass there from the striker. Lee with the ball here. Down to foul. And the ball goes across into the centre midfield. Brunt with good clearance there. Lee with the ball. Down to Mullen. He finds foul. Oh, what a shot there by the kid. Making a statement. He can play. The second of the match. Giving us that one point advantage. Mullen finds him there. He's not in the best position to take that shot. But he just curls it into the left top pocket. And 66 minute here. We do have the advantage. Ball back into the middle here, ball with the ball. Curry. Punch the ball. Nice play there by Bolton, just slowing it down. He almost got the steal there, he needs to get back in defence. Clearworth almost blocked it there, but Brunt's, ooh, risky, but nice. Shielding the defensive line, or shielding the goals on that one. Dobson here, making a bit of a break, trying to get the ball through to Mullen. Ball goes back down to Archibald. Defensively there, Clearworth finding it out, Brunt's going to have to slide. Probably enough pressure there to cause the missed shot. We will do a switch out here, we'll bring on O'Connell. And that's going to be fresh legs with Clearworth going off. Mendy with the ball. He's been a bit of a mixed bag today, Mendy. Obviously, that's a penalty on that one, but oh, that's a poor pass there from Brunt. 
really putting ourselves in a terrible position doing that. We're lucky we got the ball back all across the field here to Rathbone. Down to Fall here. Unfortunately, defensively come up, but he almost got the ball back. Ball goes wide. Brunt's going to have to slide here. Nice defensive play there by him. Just takes it out for a corner. Ball into the box. Fogbo goes up tall. Great play there by the keeper. Confidence to hold on to it. And Bolton with the ball at the moment. Holding on to it a little bit too much. Let's get the ball away. Does to Rathbone. Down to Brunt. Down to Mendy here. Defensively. Putting ourselves in a tough spot there, Mendy. And he's not getting back on defence either. Oh, that's risky. And we're over the extra time thing, but they've got a corner opportunity. All into the box. Bolton locked. Rathbone clears it. And that should be it. We pick up the three points. And, of course, our man of the match is the young kid, Mopal. Scoring two in this one on his debut for Wrexham. Great to see. And potentially we'll look to give him a little bit more games throughout the season. A 9.4 with Bolton and 8.1 in second position in our performance meter. Now, breaking news, we've put some players on transfer and we have some of them being sold at the moment, which is fantastic for our cash flow. We're desperate for that. So we got Aaron James for 170,000. Uh, I think that's great for us. We weren't going to look to use him and sending him away on loan probably wasn't going to work for us. Uh, so we do wish him all the best. We've got Liam Hall for 130000 He's gone off to Barrow. Again, doesn't look like we're going to be using him throughout the series. So we'll send him off and at least get some cash flow. And then William Boyle for 480000 We could have potentially got a little bit more for William. Um, but with his age, Mark, it was 425. We got 480. I'm quite happy with that. Uh, so uh, at least we've added roughly about 800k back into the transfer pool, which will be good for us with the youth academy, and um, hopefully picking up some um, some gems in that one. Now the last match of the episode will be against Blackpool. It is away from home. Hopefully we can put in a big performance here. If you have a look at players to watch, 11 goals. You've got uh, Marriott and then Nombi, who we did first in the last episode, currently leading the league uh, with 14 goals. So he's definitely going to be one to potentially score a couple in this one. Marriott get himself back into first position. They were going with a 5-3-2. Always a challenge with the five back. But we'll see if we can work our magic to get around the outside of them. And uh, we're looking that Brunt is going to hold down that centre-back position with O'Connell now moving to the bench. Uh, and the decision made to continue to develop him uh, into potential a starter next season uh, long-term or a very solid backup. Russell with a nice ball down here to Mullen. Marriott's run a nice line, gets it pull through. Marriott, back to Mullen here. Mullen. Oh, Mullen. Super Mullen. 14th goal of the season. But what a combination there from Marriott. He didn't get too greedy. He got the ball. Saw his, his partner was wide open for the, the return pass. He gets the ball back to him. And the number 10 for Wrexham. Scores a beautiful goal. So Morgan with the ball now for Blackpool. Down to Beasley. Through to Husband. Got Barnett pushing up here. Colson with it at the moment. Back into the middle there. Rathbone trying to support Barnett. Nice defensive play there from Barnett. Lee's pushing up as well. He miscues on that one. Colson wrong foots him. Clear work defensively comes up aggressively. It's going to be a penalty, unfortunately. I think a foot to the foot. Well, he stood on the foot on that one. Shot opportunity here for Blackpool. Way over 
the top there by Morgan. Unable to keep the ball down over the top of the wall. Clear worth here. A long pass out here to Barnett. Down to Rathbone. Back to Barnett. Nice little combination here. Marriott working. Barnett gets the ball back. He does have Mullen on the inside. But Colson cuts it off there. Dobson miscues on the header. Ball back into the middle here. McLean's going to have to push. Got Gabriel with it at the moment. Russell sliding across as well. Nice play there from McLean, but he can't get past the player. Gets caught up with his legs. Evans with the ball at the moment. Rhodes. Nice play there by Dobson. Swung across the support, but the ball goes back on the inside. Clean, wrong-footed. Rode with the ball. And the front comes out. Ball back into the middle. Cross into the box here. Nice play there from Dobson. Rathbone with the ball at the moment. He does have Barnett on the outside. He does use him. Barnett with a beautiful ball down to Marriott. Oh, down to Russell here, the young kid. And he scores his first, Dominic Russell. He's on the scoreboard for his career. He's got one goal, one assist so far from joining us from the Youth Academy. And Marriott, once again, delivering a beautiful assist. And a great shot there from from Russell hopefully a sign of things to come for the young kid obviously playing centre mid can, can play Cam and that could be the future position for him Clearworth nice defensive play there by Clearworth but unfortunately just couldn't get a clean ball away to his teammate McLean sliding across Russell pushing down as well Gabriel just finds Evans there, so Dobson's going to have to support. Does well there, Dobson. Ball back here to Pennington, to Evans. Nice play there by Lee. Can't get the ball down to Mullen. And this should be it for the first half. Throw in, and that should be about it on this one. We do have that two-point advantage going into the break. There's been two great assists, Marriott to Mullen, Marriott to Dominic Russell for his first goal for Wrexham. The, the young kid currently in the number 50 for Wrexham. Now can we potentially give Marriott a goal for all his hard efforts? Ball goes down to him at the moment, into the corner. Back to Rathbone, to Russell. Finds McLean. Nice pass through the lead here. Hasn't scored a goal yet. That was a difficult angle for him to even get an attempt away. Clearworth here. Down to Rathbone. Nice pass to Lee. There's going to be another attempt. I think it's going to be a little bit too far out. 26 minutes. Oh, sorry. 26 metres, not minutes. We'll put it a little bit too far across and didn't see that until we started kicking it that we had it on chip there that was a poor attempt there from Lee we should have potentially just chipped it in the box and allowed one of the big guys to try and get ahead to that one nice play there from Russell nice steal ball down to Mullen here tries to find Marriott Marriott and there we have it he's 13th of the career season obviously he's 12th in the league one the score one in the Carabao Cup, I believe, as well. And a nice ball there from Mary, uh, from Mullen. And Marriott comes up. A great performance from him, from him in this one. Two assists and one goal. Got Barnett pushing up here. Colson. Blackpool looking at what they can do here. They're currently trailing 3-0. They're looking at ways to try and break the line at the moment. But we're putting pressure on them. Passes are just going back. 
Olsen. We're going to cause a mistake here if they keep doing this. Morgan with the ball. Back out here to Colson. Dobson trying to get in front of that one. Does well. Beautiful play there from Dobson. Barnett tries to get the pass down. Nice play there by Rathbone, though. Pulls it into the middle. It's got Mullen. Finds Russell. Finds Mullen on this one. Oh, shit, he's going to be a good offside. Oh, that was a good play there. Probably just needed Russell to hit that straight down the Mullen as soon as it got to his foot. We will do a switch out here. Bring on Luke Bolton for, for Barnett. Obviously played phenomenal in that last match. Bolton. With the way Mendy played in the left back position, I think potentially that we, while Wright is his preferred side, Bolton, he, he played well. We might look to put him on the left, um, at least for the the interim once McLean does retire. He obviously still needs to announce that retirement as well. I'm just preempting a 35 year old left back. Be hard for him to continue to, uh, to play that position. It's very demanding, that's for sure. Mullen trying to push down here, same with Marriott. We're back in the middle. Casey. Colson got the ball at the moment. Would love to keep a clean sheet here. We don't have much longer to go. Beasley down to Colson. Nice play there from Bolton. Through to Lee here. We'll chip over the top to Mullen. Gets the ball, Mullen. Oh, block shot attempt. And Lee's going to have to slide out here to support McLean. Gabriel with the pass in, and there we have it. Another clean sheet for Conquo. Pushing for his golden gloves of the season in League One. Looking at performance-wise, surely Marriott would be our best player. 72 to 28 split on possession, and there you have it. 10 out of 10 performance from Marriott. Two assists, one goal, and a 9.8 from Mullen. And he had one goal and one assist. Now, before we wrap up this episode, we'll have a bit of a look at the Youth Academy. We've had some scout reports come back here, and uh, we'll have a quick look at this one to wrap up the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you do hit that like button as it does help the channel grow. And if you're new around here and want to enjoy the series, make sure you do hit subscribe. We've got a lot more to come in this series and obviously more to come after this one as well. Looking at the players, we've got more that could be a potential. Dave, Davey, I think, could work for us. Park, not so much. It's uh, overall, you know, he's, he's about average on that one. I would say not uh, a player that will be looking to keep. You got Fisher, you got Dawson, you got Moore, Smith, Davy, Allen, and Chandler coming through. Now, what we'll be looking to do with these uh, players from England is we're going to give them another month to scout. We'll see if any of their skills change okay, over the course of the month, and then uh, we'll look to remove some players if if we need to on that one. A couple of additionals coming through. But obviously, Gillingham's probably the, the one that's sticking out here in Wales. Uh, so we've got Howes that we'll, we'll let go because not so much. Um, Collins is in there as well. He's new. Really not doing much there. Lloyd, not much on that one. And Thomas, Evans, Prosser, Gillingham. And the last one would be Wright. So they're the five that will continue to scout here in Wales. And that is, of course, the left and right back. Evans needs to move into a left back position. He's currently only in the left midfield position. Uh, so that would be a movement there that we need to look to do. Being realistic about Prosser, I just don't think we're going to be looking to play him, even if he did join the Youth Academy. So we will let him go. And we'll stick with these four for another at least a month and evaluate if uh, they're going to be any good going into um, going into the Youth Academy from there. So that's going to be it for this episode. Once again, appreciate all the support, all the comments and likes on the community board as well. It's much appreciated. 
It helps me make these videos because you guys are involved with that one. So continue to let me know which direction we should be going when I do throw up a community choice uh, option on the board. So once again, appreciate all the support. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next episode.